to a new episode of How to Lady. I'm your host Janice. And I'm June. How to Lady is a series about all things female related. And today we're going to be talking about facial masks. I love masks. They're so pampering. Yeah, this is actually the episode I was very excited about. There's so many masks out there like pay masks, oxygenating masks, peel off masks, and then like overnight masks, sleeping masks. Yeah, so today we got a special guest to join us to share her expert tips with us on masks. Let's welcome Rachel! Yay! <laughs> Thanks so much for joining us today. Mm -hmm. Thank you for having me. Yeah, so what have you been up to recently? Um, recently, I've been busy with my cafe. So we are at an external event doing uh, milkshakes, crudodo and cotton candy. Ooh, yeah. sounds yummy. Yeah, I'm hungry yeah. actually. Oh, so. <laughs> so today we invited you to share with us any expert tips that you have on like facial masks. Mm -hmm. Because we love facial masks. Yeah, and we too. can tell that you know you have very nice skin. Yeah, so. Yeah. <laughs> it's really yeah. very smooth. Eh. No, it's like, I, I, as, uh, like you mentioned earlier, I try to put masks as much as possible, like maybe three to four times a week. Wow. Yeah. I think I like to use moisturizing masks, like mm -hmm. hydrating, because I feel like uh, my skin gets dry quite often. Mm -hmm. So I have to keep putting on like hydrating masks to just make my skin have the dewy look. Uh. Otherwise, mm -hmm. it's like very dry and look very tired. You want to share with us uh, what kind of mask? there out there in the market. Okay, so uh, this is actually the most common mask in the market. This is actually the sheet mask. So it's very popular because it's very convenient to use. You just put it on and then uh, put it on for about 15 to 20 minutes, remove it and just chuck it into the dustbin. And then there's also the type with like very fancy embossed design like this lace mask. Oh, nice! Nice. nice! I know, right? It's very, yeah. very pretty. So you can actually look chill when you put on masks, right? So cool! Yeah. Yeah. So you like a selfie, that's yeah, the story. Like, you know, no filter! <laughs> okay, and then uh, this is actually the ampule mask. Mm. So uh, ampule mask actually is quite similar to sheet mask. Mm. Uh, how sheet mask works is like the manufacturer will actually cut out the mask out of paper or mm. a cloth mm. and then soak it in a certain like serum. So mm. this one is actually ampule mask. So instead of soaking it in serum, it soaks in an uh, ampule. Yeah. Oh. So, so it's more concentrated yeah, essence, correct. is it? Because ampule oh. actually has like smaller molecules, it's easier for your skin to absorb. And right. then it's like a super serum. Yeah, so when you need like an emergency hydrating leave, you can actually use an ampule mask. Oh, okay, okay. Mm. Right. Mm. Comes in handy. So there's also like different fabrics for masks. Instead of like paper or cloth, there's also the biocellulose type. So this is very gentle for the skin and also helps with absorption. Mm. Oh, so it's so like, like those transparent, transparent mm. type, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, and then okay. when you put it on your face, right, you can actually just like walk around and then you don't need to scared that it falls off. It's good for people who oh, just cannot sticks. sit. Yeah, yeah, who cannot sit still and then you just like... But yeah. usually I just like watch shows. I watch TV, yeah. Like, yeah. Otherwise, sick. if you fall asleep with the mask, it's actually not it's very, very good. good. Yeah, yeah, it's not very good. It will dry out your mm. face as well. Yeah. yeah. Actually, I tried before falling asleep with masks. In the middle of the night, I wake up and it's like, oh my god, it's so dry and I feel like it's worse for your skin. There's also the gel type of mask. Yeah. So gel mask is also like quite similar to sheet mask. Mm. It stays on your skin uh, without falling off, but then it's also better at locking in moisture. Mm. So you see like all those eye masks, right? Actually, it's always like gel type because moisture is actually very important for the eye area to mm. prevent wrinkles. Wow. And then there's also the in shower mask. This one is what? very special. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Yeah. What's so in shower mask? In yeah. shower mask is when you put on first and then you go to shower, you wash your hair and wash your body, and then after that you wash off the mask. So efficient. Yeah, it's so convenient because yeah. like while you shower, there's like the steam and then it helps with absorbing all the goodness of the mask. And how clay mask work is like it acts as a glue. So when you put it on your face mm. uh, and then after that when you wash it off, it actually sticks all the impurities and sebum from your face. And when you wash it off, it just comes off all together. Wow, it's like a mm. filter. It just has to suck everything yeah. out. Right. Love oh, I know there's like different kind of clay masks as well, yeah. right? There's a volcanic clay. Yeah. Know what there are different clay. color clay masks as well yeah. for yeah. different kind of skin type. Yeah. Mm. There's like the red clay, yeah. white clay, and green clay. So green clay is actually the most common type and it's most versatile for mm. most skin type. And then if you have like sensitive skin, you should actually use like white clay mask. That one is less absorbent, so uh, it's less harsh on your skin. Uh -huh. And then if you have like super oily skin, you should try the red mask. Uh -huh. So the red clay mask actually is the most absorbent, so it can really just strip away all the oil and all the dirt from your face. Uh -huh. yeah. So does that mean like clay mask is more suited for like oily skin? People with dry mm. skin shouldn't do too uh, often. Actually, dry skin can also use uh, clay mask. Mm. Uh, like there are some clay masks that has hydrating properties. Uh -huh. So while you do the mask on, you can still get like those oh, hydrating, hydrating goodness. Oh, yeah. that's cool. mm. So there's also like the sleeping mask. This one is very convenient because you can just apply it on your face and then just fall asleep. It's favorite. my favourite. My favourite. Yeah. Yeah. My favourite. Because like you don't need to do anything, you don't need to wash, you just like I put. Know. I know. Mm. Yeah, it's like, oh, okay, can I, I, I'm so pretty now. <laughs> you wake up all dewy and dewy. Yeah, it's like, oh, why sleeping mask though? Like, what, what does it do? Actually, sleeping mask helps with like preventing the moisturiser on your face from evaporating while you sleep. Oh. 
and then also it helps to uh, let the active ingredients penetrate into your skin better. So is it recommended? Like how often should I use a sleeping mask? Mm, if you have dry skin, I think you can actually use it almost every day. Okay. But if you have oily skin, I would recommend you to use it sparingly because if you were to use it very often, right, mm. it might actually trap the oil under your skin. Oh no. Yeah. And then this is the peel off mask. Uh -huh. So how the peel off mask works is also similar to the clay mask. When you apply it on your skin, when you peel it out, mm -hmm. it just removes all the impurities and dirt from your face as well. Yeah. Mm. I always feel very clean after using a peel off mask. Mm. Like, oh, like, yes. But actually, if like it peels off your hair and follicles, it's not so good for your skin, especially if you have like sensitive skin. Right. So if you really want to use like a peel off mask, you can actually go for the more gentler kind. Oh, okay, mm. okay. Throughout the whole thing, I keep hearing like skin type, skin type, skin type. Mm -hmm. So how do you tell what kind of skin type yeah. you have? So if at the end of the day you feel that like your skin is very oily and then you wash it off, you feel your skin is very tight, it's probably like combination type skin. Mm. So most people have combination type skin. Yes, and then me. yeah. And if your skin is very, very oily, it probably means your skin is very dry. Mm. So the oil actually, your body produces a lot of oil to make up for the lack of moisture in your skin. Mm. So that's when you have dry skin. Mm. Mm. So like for dry skin people try to avoid uh, clay mask mm. because it will actually strip off more moisture from your skin. Yeah. Instead go for like the hydrating type. Yes. And then if you have Combination skin actually is quite common, mm. so most people will go for like hydrating uh, mask and mm. also like maybe gel mask. Mm. And if you have like oily and pimple prone skin, you can actually just go for the peel off mask and then just you know strip off as much of the dirt as possible. Yeah, try different type of mask and then see which is suitable for your skin. Actually, your body will tell you like whether or not this product is good for you. Mm. So sometimes you'll do like a little test patch on your hand mm. just to just in case when you try a new product, just to see if you are like allergic to the product. Mm. And then after that, you slowly move towards your face. Over time, if you see the results and then you know that, okay, this works on my skin. And then some products actually quite say like you use and then after that, you break out. That's when you know that, you know, it's not good yeah. for the skin. I think we try a lot of different yeah. products. Yeah. Yeah. Trial and error, like, I think that's what beauty is all about. Now that we've seen all these products, all these mm -hmm. masks, do you want to try them? Yes! Definitely. Okay, um, which one do you want to try? I'll go for the lace. Oh, oh nice. I want to meet you! Let's do it! <laughs> I think I'm going to go for the cellulose one. It looks so cool. Let's okay, see what I like. think I'll go for the peel-off mask. Mm. Um, because I have oilier skin mm -hmm. and I really like the you know, the peel-off and I'll just like to scrutinize <laughs> like whether there's yeah. any junk on it at the end of the day. Yeah. Mm. So, let's go. Let's try. Oh, yours is so pretty! So pretty, right? Okay, how was mine so thick? Okay. Oh, it's inside. I'm done. That's the good thing about sheet mask, right? Mm -hmm. It's very fast. How are you guys so fast? Wait. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm done. Me too. Okay. Let's sit down and wait. Woohoo! Okay, so like, they are not ready yet, but I can feel like my peel off mask is kind of dry already. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to peel off and see whether there's any junk on it. Okay. So you always start from the bottom up. Yeah. Right? What if you start from. There's wrinkles, ah! Oh. I don't want to have wrinkles. It's like a snake shedding skin. Yeah. But it feels very good. I, lo I love peeling masks. Yeah, it's very cathartic, right? It feels like everything is being like sucked out. Yeah. You feel like you have a new layer of skin coming mm -hmm. out. Look at my shedded skin. Actually, the skin looks very bright after that. Yeah, She's this is the thing about peel off mask, right? It really takes up all the dead skin cells, yeah. impurities, and everything. Mm. Yeah, it's so like better at like exfoliating than just like mm. a taro one. Okay, so I'm done and I'm gonna remove my mask now. Ta da! Baby mm. skin! It's actually really refreshing and like it sticks on. I could like do whatever I want to do and it doesn't really fall off. Mm -hmm. It feels like I'm so my skin's so supple now. Mm. So I look like Angela Baby now. Yes, <laughs> Angela Baby. <laughs> That's the thing about like masks, right? You always feel so refreshed and yeah. clean after that. My favorite sheet mask. Yeah. So after you take out a sheet mask, you can like just gently pat your skin mm. to like for better absorption. So Rachel, thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you for having me. This is my favourite like filming session ever because we get to like put masks and it's yeah. like super pampering. So for this episode's giveaway, we're giving away this set of facial masks. All you need to do is share with us what is your favourite facial mask on Instagram. Mm -hmm. Remember to hashtag HDL Toggle. Contest ends in a week. We'll see you next episode. Bye! Bye.